My name is Jan and I'm a young storyteller. My story name is House Party and my story is about heroes and villains fighting, fighting it out and then at the end they have a big party. What inspired me to write my story was that I just like to have fun and make people laugh. I consider myself a class clown in school. Hi, I'm Alyssa. I'm a young storyteller. The name of my story was Be Careful What You Wish For, and it was about two girls who... Hmm. Who need to be careful what they wish for. Yeah. I watch a lot of YouTube, TV, and movies, and those, I just took little pieces from different movies, put them to one, and put a little bit of my imagination to it. My name is Victoria, and I'm a young storyteller. My story is called um, Mind Control Guinea Pigs, and it's about these, these agent animals that have to defeat from mind controlling everybody in the town. I always wondered if animals would really want to take over the world. I'm Michael Andrew, and I was a young storyteller. My story is called Night of the Living Tacos 2 Cockroach Invasion. It was about, um, about the tacos came back to life. It was a sequel to my brother's Night of the Living Tacos 1. I hope my little brothers make a, a Night of the Living Tacos 3. My name is Zoe, and I am a young storyteller. Some people will watch these really scary movies like Chucky and Goosebumps. These movies are brainwashing people, but people just mistake dolls for these little m minions. And I, I think the reason that that I should talk for them is because they can't talk for themselves. And I think that I should be, I, I don't think they're that scary. I don't think they're that bad. I, I think they're pretty cool. So. <laughs> Young Storytellers helped me improve in all my writing with all my classes. And I just overall think I'm a better writer after Young Storytellers. It helped me with the confidence at home and uh, young storyteller. It kind of helped me um, talk to more people and socialize better because because I didn't really talk to a lot of people back then. It helped me make a lot of friends and gave me the confidence to be here. Well like when I'm like I've been watching too much YouTube for the day or too much TV for the day I just write a mini story because we write a lot in in English and history and science so I'm used to it now. Before Young Storytellers, I was scared to say anything that I thought and felt because I thought people would judge me for it. Then Young Storytellers taught me that just because someone says, no, your movie sucks, you don't have to listen to them because they don't control your imagination. You, you control your, your imagination. Mikey was, is shy in a way that he doesn't like to write things because he feels people are gonna make fun of him. The young storytellers, I think it brought him a lot of confidence. I've noticed that she's just a lot more confident in sharing her thoughts and ideas. She's really a lot more expressive. I was so proud when I heard that her script was chosen because I also know how hard she worked on it. Oh, so proud of you. I think other kids should do young storytellers because it can also help you improve in your writing and become a better writer overall. I'm crushing school. It's on the floor crushed. <laughs> Enjoy the big show! Here comes the big show. Enjoy the big show. Enjoy the big show. Get ready for the big show. Cut.